Assalamu alaikum my dear students. Hello, how are you all? Hope you were fine by the grace of Almighty Allah. Welcome to NIV Zoom School and this is Ariful Islam, Assistant Teacher of English, National Education School, Boarding Shift. Today, I am going to conduct an English Literature class for Class 1 students. Our today's topic, Unit 3, True False, Plus, Fill in the Blanks, Sit Up Link. So, my dear students, open your English buzzword book and go to page number 25, the naughty little t-shirt. So, let's see our today's class. Class 1, subject English Literature, topic unit 3, fill in the blanks, plus true false CW, Tom Harvey, lecture 8, no SW today, teacher Eiffel Islam, this is my mobile number and today's date. So, let's start the class. <coughs> so, you can see, Unit 3, the naughty t-shirt, fill in the blanks. Number 1, little t-shirt dash on a clothes line. Little t-shirt dash on a clothes line. So let's go to the text again. Let's go to the text. You can see, little t-shirt hangs on a clothes line. So in this sentence, the word hangs is missing. So little t-shirt hangs on a clothes line. So in the fill in the gap, we will write little t-shirt dash on a clothes line. Which word is missing? Hangs. H A N G S. So hangs. Little t-shirt hangs on a clothes line. The word hangs is missing. Number two, rabbit is dash. Rabbit is dash. So which, let's go to the text again. Let's go to the text again. So, come here, please. Look at me, rabbit. He shouts, rabbit is dash. So, rabbit is scared. So, in, in the fill in the blanks, the word scared is missing. So, we will write the answer. Let's go. So, number two, rabbit is dash. So, answer will be, which word is missing? Scared, S-C-A-R-E-D, scared, S-C-A-R-E-D. So, rabbit is scared. In this sentence, the word scared is missing. Number three, little t-shirt dash loudly. There is a correction, I'm sorry. So, little t-shirt dash loudly. So, number three, little t-shirt dash loudly. Let's go to the book again. You can see in the book, little t-shirt laughs loudly. Little t-shirt laughs. So in this sentence, the word laughs, L-A-U-G-S, laughs is missing. So we will write the answer. Let's go to the number three, little t-shirt laughs, L-A-U-G-S-S. Why we are giving S? Because little t-shirt want t-shirt. That's why we are adding S after the verb. So little t-shirt laughs loudly. Next number, true false. Number one, Mr. Wayne becomes angry. True or false. Let's go to the text again. So Mr. Wind hears these. He is angry. So in this sentence, who is he? He is a pronoun. And he is Mr. Wind. Okay, so he is angry, that means Mr. Wind is angry. So this is true. So number one, Mr. Wind becomes angry. This will be true. In the exam also, you will, you will not write like this, T. Your answer will be incorrect. You have to write the full word, true. T-R-U-E, true. Okay, Mr. Wind becomes angry, true. T-R-U-E, true. Number two. Rabbit is scared. So, let's go to the text again. We did in the fill in the blanks. The rabbit is scared. This is also true. Let's go to the number two. Rabbit is scared. This is also true. So, in the exam, you will also write true. T R V, not T. Okay. Let's number number three. Mr. Wind. Blows softly. True or false? 
let's go to the text again so he blows hard mr he is angry he blows hard hard means strongly and sloppily means slowly you can see in the picture also mr wind blows hard very strongly so this sentence number three mr wind blows softly is false because mr winds blows hard so this one is false f a l a c false so let's read again so fill in the blanks number one little t-shirt dash on a clothesline the answer will be hangs on a clothesline number two rabbit is dash so rabbit is scared rabbit is afraid frightened spelling s-c-a-r-e-t number three little t-shirt dash loudly so little t-shirt loves l-a-u-z-a says loves loudly true false number one mr wind becomes angry this is true number two rabbit is scared this is also true number three mr wind blows softly false because mr wind blows hard very strongly okay my dear students so no sw today my dear students keep practicing at home about your parents stay safe stable see you again till then allah peace assalamu alaikum